a little bit of a chill in the air in Des Moines this morning. Currently 57 degrees, but our morning low so far has been 55. That's as cool as we have been since June 4th. So going on about two and a half months since we felt this type of weather here in Des Moines. And it's even cooler elsewhere. 54 in Grinnell, 4 Dodge, 50 in Audubon, 49 right now in Spencer. Uh, the good news, the winds are lighter today. That's how it's going to stay all day long around that 5 to 10 mile per hour range. On the muggy meter, we're way at the bottom. So not that typical summer humidity expected today. Uh, it's going to be rather refreshingly dry uh, for most of us. And we're looking at sunny skies for most of us pretty much from start to finish. No rain in the forecast today as we roll through the future tracker. Uh, it's going to be pretty much clear throughout the state of Iowa. Things start to change tomorrow. We get a little moisture to return to the area starting out west with clouds filling in late Thursday morning, moving into central Iowa Thursday afternoon. Spotty showers possible in the afternoon for the western half of the state, but everyone's best chance for rain, for rain is going to be Thursday night through Friday morning. They'll start to pop up out west around midnight on Friday morning, sweeping across the state before sunrise, and then we'll probably see most of the thunderstorms stay in eastern Iowa by Friday afternoon. There is a slight chance come some of those storms Thursday night into Friday morning could be severe. More severe storms are possible Friday afternoon for the areas highlighted in yellow, but as you can see, that's east of Des Moines. I really do think most of the day in central and western Iowa will end up being dry on Friday. Back to today, highs in the 70s again. That makes it three straight days for most of us. 75 in Grinnell and 76 in Creston. Uh, we will be in the 70s for the fourth day in a row tomorrow, but after that the heat is back. Mid 80s on Friday, 90s returns starting on Saturday, and I think those will stick around through the first couple of days of the work week next week up to 94 by next Tuesday.